Podcast. All right, thanks, fellas. And we're looking at a nice morning to go outside and maybe eat some brunch. Will and Brendan just talking about brunch. And I'll tell you what, it will be kind of a warm brunch out there. Temperatures warming up quickly. The muggies will take their time leaving us today, especially along the south coast, and a refreshing Monday on the way as that humidity starts to drop. But it has not dropped yet for most of us. Look at this dew point still in the upper 60s in Providence, 70 in Newport, 70 Westerly, 65 in Smithfield. So it's in places like Smithfield, Burville, out towards West Greenwich. You're going to be the first to say bye bye to that humidity today. And then it takes a little while longer to say goodbye to it for places on the south coast. You can see Oakland Beach and Warwick. Already some boat traffic out there. Why not? It'll be a beautiful day on the water. East Providence looking towards Providence showing a warm morning here. 75 in Providence, 76 Newport, 78 westerly, just two degrees shy of the 80s right now. And winds are out of the northwest in Providence at six miles an hour, seven in Smithfield. They're variable in Newport right now at five miles an hour. You know, these winds from the north will help kind of push in that lower humidity today but it's not going to be that consistent. I think near the coast where the boundary is kind of stalled up, we'll be shifting around those winds and at times we'll be coming in from a more southerly direction and that will keep the humidity around for a bit. And that's because the stalled front isn't going anywhere today. At least if it is, it's not moving all that quickly and you can see that will have an effect on the chance of showers today. But I'm thinking most, if not all of Sunday is actually rain free across our area. The best chance to pick up a quick shower I think would be out towards the Cape Cod Canal, Eastern Massachusetts. Even though this is showing up with a few blips across Rhode Island, I think our chance to get the showers is quite low here in the Ocean State today. Noontime temperature 83, 86, 3 o'clock in the afternoon and on the water and at the beach looking great. Low 80s. I don't think we have quite as strong of a sea breeze as we had yesterday. So just keep that in mind if you were at the beach yesterday and you're heading down there today and you're wondering if it was going to be a repeat. Just a few subtle changes today. And then uh, along the water, we're talking low to mid 80s for high temperatures. New Bedford around 85. Mid to upper 80s from Providence into Smithfield, Taunton, West Warwick, Johnston. You get out into Coventry, we're talking about mid to upper 80s as well. And then tonight, here's where things start to change. If you're out and about this evening, it's comfortable, low 70s. And then check out these numbers. This is an open up the window kind of night. A lot of you that have been using the air conditioner over the past several nights like I have. You may not need to do that tonight. In fact, look at this in Smithfield tomorrow morning. Upper 50s, low 60s for Providence, upper 50s potentially here for Newport. I wouldn't be surprised if places like West Greenwich get into the mid 50s. You may also see that for portions of Bristol County, Massachusetts. So that will be a nice change. And then tomorrow afternoon, very, very nice. If you earn a living outdoors, you combine the low humidity with the low 80s and it will be very pleasant outside. On the water today, winds out of the west at around five knots, waves two feet in Narragansett Bay, high tide 11, 11 this morning, low tide 443 in the afternoon. And hop aboard the humidity roller coaster. We drop that humidity throughout today. Tomorrow is refreshing and then Tuesday and Wednesday humidity comes back and that will also bring in the chance of some showers and thunderstorms, especially on Wednesday. You can see that reflected here in the seven day forecast where we keep it dry the next couple days. A few showers possible Tuesday, some strong storms possible Wednesday and some showers possible Thursday as well. And then a front should knock out that humidity and next Saturday, if this forecast holds up, looks very comfortable. Mostly sunny skies high of 83. You can always get an updated forecast over on our website at WPRI.com.